everyone and welcome back to my channel so it may look like i'm in my pajamas and i am i have been up and i've been dressed in multiple outfits today so this is definitely not my first outfit and i didn't sleep in these last night so just to let you know i've just put them on to film the beginning of this video i've just filmed a pre-mark try on haul which i think should be up on my channel by now um but i also did some shopping in marks and spencers um and i don't really shop in marks and spencers very often so i thought for anyone like me who doesn't really know what marks and spencers have out it may be quite a good thing to film so i hope you enjoy it um for anyone who's new to my channel i hello first of all my name's kelly and i am a uk size 18 Sometimes I can be a 20 on the bottom because I've got quite wide hips and uh, I'm five foot two and a half so hopefully that's helpful for anyone looking to see how these things fit. Um, but yeah, let's get into it. It's only a little haul, it's not a big haul at all, it's only like a couple of bits but they are good so I'm going to show you. Okay, so first thing I'm going to show you is a pack of two and these are, again these are underwear so I'm going to start with underwear and then go on to clothes. These are something that I saw one of my YouTubers that I watch called Brogan Tate. She spoke about these in her video um, because she wears them when she goes to Disney World. And I'm going to Disney World soon and I wanted to, basically the vibe of Disney World is being as comfortable as possible whilst looking as Disney-like as possible. So I'm going comfortable, I'm not wearing shorts anymore that are super uncomfortable, um, that I don't like in pictures, I don't like wearing them, they ride up, I'm just not doing it this year. I've decided that's not my vibe anymore, I'm going for something completely different. Um, obviously I'm going to wear shorts but not the same kind of things but I'm going to wear a lot of dresses and she spoke about these chafing shorts from Marks and Spencers. I think these are actually a really really good price. Um, they are a two pack, they're £20 for two. I've got them in a size 16 to 18. What I love about Marks and Spencer's underwear, I've got quite a lot of Marks and Spencer's underwear actually, um, not the clothes, but I've got a lot of underwear, is that they have all different skin tones, which I think should be a given, but the fact that it's there, I think there is a really good variety of choice. Um, and I didn't even see these to begin with. I saw a different colour, like a camel colour, which I loved. And then I spotted these and I thought, Do you know what, I think these are probably more the ones that I should go for. Um, and I tried them on, I won't put them on right now because you will see everything. But I really, really like them. Admittedly, I haven't worn them out yet, but my, I think my mum was saying that she's worn them and she really liked them. And the material, as someone who wears a lot of shapewear during the summer months, not really at the moment, but I, the shapewear factor and comfortability is usually really uncomfortable. And this was something I found when I was actually shopping for my wedding dress and looking for my shapewear for my wedding dress. Everything is uncomfortable. Like I have gone through so many different types of underwear and shapewear, nothing is comfortable. So this for me kind of feels like a two, like killing two birds with one stone. Like it is super, super comfortable and has a really good purpose. So obviously where I'm wearing, when I'm wearing dresses on holiday, they will just feel well obviously chafing is awful anyway but it will just feel super comfortable so these are the ones i've already worn so you can see they're kind of stretched out well you can't really see it. they're a little bit stretched out um i've got two pairs i'm not too sure if i'm going to get some more i may actually get a black set as well um but yeah i haven't actually worn them yet to test them out for a full day because there hasn't been a day where the weather has been dry enough or hot enough to wear just like a dress um but if i do try them out i'll put it on my instagram stories to see how i get on maybe before i buy another pair actually um but yeah so they were recommended and um re i mean the material is really light really breathable not too restricting you're not going to be like sitting down and having stuff digging in you when you're sitting down um so yeah really really happy so far with those and i've just dropped them I'm really happy with those so far the next one oh my god this dress this dress is such a bit of me this was 35 pound i got it in a size 18 and it is a milkmaid dress i'm going to show you when i pan it on when i put it on i'm going to pan down in a minute so you can see um so yeah this was 35 pound which is more 
than I usually spend on dresses like this. However, I did get one similar to this from Hollister not long ago, and that was 45, but I think it's 49 and I've got a 10 pound discount, so pretty, I suppose pretty similar in price. Um, it is the Milk Maple with like a tie and um, a bit of the front, and I just love this material. It's like the really lovely, you can kind of see it's like cheesecloth material. I think this is really flattering. I've tried it on before, so I'm gonna show you what it looks like now. I love it, I absolutely love it. Right, so. This is what it looks like. Hopefully you can see. There you go. So you can kind of see, it literally sits just above my ankles, which I think is such a flattering length. Um, I've got a little crop top bralette on at the moment, so you can see that, but obviously I wouldn't, I probably wouldn't wear a bra with this um, when I wear this out. But I just thought this is the most comfortable thing to go out in. I've got a black one like this from New Look, which I think I got last year. Um, and I've got so much wear out of it and I think this, I've actually got something down here, something I made earlier. For another, another outfit, these sandals which are really really old from Boohoo which I love and they, ne don't, they don't do them anymore um, like this because I really want to get some more pairs in different colours and this little woven straw bag again which was from Boohoo a couple of years ago. Um, this is like my dream going to a garden centre outfit on a Saturday or Sunday, pop into blue water going out for lunch, basically doing everything. I could do everything in this dress because it's such a versatile, comfortable dress. And I personally think for my um, shape, this is the most flattering style on me. I feel like coming in at my waist, which is obviously my narrowest point, and like skimming over my hips, I do actually have the, uh, the cycling chafe, chafe shorts on, so you can kind of see where they come to. Um, but yeah, I love this. I actually think I'm gonna get so much wear out of it. I'm so happy that I got it and I love it. I love the colour, I love everything. Okay, so the last thing is these pair, these pair, this pair. These I've got in a size 20. When you first look at them, maybe it's just me, they don't look as wide as I'd like them to look for a 20. I'd want them to be just a little bit bigger. Um, so they've got two pockets on the bum. It's probably a little bit too overexposed. There you go. You can kind of see there's two pockets on the bum cheeks and um, these I got in a size 20 and they were £19.50 and I'm going to show you what they look like on. Okay so these are the shorts on. I'm going to be honest these are as tight as I will go with shorts. Um, as I said these are probably not going to be something that I wear to the parks because I mean they're not uncomfortable but they're not as comfortable as a dress and cycling shorts underneath, um, but they feel very good quality. They kind of just skim over my hips, probably quite well actually. Um, obviously I've got this on with just a little crop top from uh, Primark at the moment, but I've got this which is on my Primark haul. Um, I've got this little crinkle cut shirt which would look quite cute with this as well. Um, and yeah, I, I think I'm gonna keep these. Um, admittedly, I would have probably preferred if they were just a tiny bit tiny bit wider um but they're not bad quite comfortably i can sit down in them and um, they're not like digging into my chest but yeah i i mean i really like them i think if they were just a tiny bit bigger i'd like them even more um but maybe it's just because i'm used to having things slightly bigger and more comfortable than um than snug fitting but yeah so these are the shorts and for £19.50, I think the price isn't bad. They're probably quite similar to things in like F and F and ASOS. So yeah, not not uh not mad about the price whatsoever. But yeah, so these are the shorts. So that is everything for this video. I really, really hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you very, very soon for another video. Bye!